Hello, everybody. How are you all doing? Hope you're having a great day today. First of all, Merry Christmas Eve to all of you. And if I don't see you anymore till 2021, a Happy New Year as well. However, 2021 will be starting a little slow. Not a lot of new games coming out in January. That's because the fiscal year for games doesn't start until somewhere in March. But there are still some gems coming out next month. So kick back, relax, and here are a few games you can look forward to. Hitman 3 is the dramatic end to the World of Assassination trilogy and takes players around the world to the most beautiful sandbox locations. Agent 47 returns as a ruthless professional for the most important contract of his career. Enjoy unprecedented freedom to achieve your goals in a world that responds to everything you do. Thanks to IO Interactive's award-winning Glacier technology, the Hitman 3 game world offers players an unprecedented scope to make their own choices and tackle situations in different ways. Hitman 3 is expected to release January 20th for the PlayStation 4, 5, Xbox One, Xbox Series, Stadia, PC, and Switch. Three years have passed since Ryza's secret grand adventure on Kirken Island. When Ryza receives a letter from an old friend, she gets inspired to leave the island and venture out to the royal capital Azra Am Baird. However, this leads to the beginning of an imaginative new adventure involving the pursuit of the mysteries of the ruins surrounding the royal capital and a meeting with a strange creature that will change her life forever. Atelier Ryza 2 is expected to release January 26th for the PlayStation 4, 5, PC, and Switch. Besiege Great Khans, Imperial Warlords, and Shogun Commanders and Stronghold Warlords, the next RTS in Firefly Studios' classic castle sim series. The first stronghold to recreate the castle economy of East Asia, Warlords let you take command of Mongol hordes, Imperial warriors, and Samurai clansmen as you lay siege to Japanese castles and fortified Chinese cities. Besiege historical rulers using new gunpowder-fueled siege weapons, classic units, and a completely new way to play Stronghold. Stronghold Warlords is expected to release the 26th of January exclusively for the PC. This Gaia 6 Defiance of Destiny unites a grim yet touching story with insane tactical combat while introducing gameplay elements never before seen in previous installments. As a result, new and returning players alike can craft a truly memorable and unique journey through the netherworld. Bring the pain in battle with special attacks and support from a plethora of ally units. Customizable settings such as auto, retry and replay allow both hardcore and casual players to fight their own way. And should things take a turn for the worst, use Super Reincarnation to rejoin the fight and keep trying until you succeed. This Gaia 6 Defiance of Destiny is expected to release January 28th for the PlayStation 4. A Switch version will be available later in the year. <laughs> the Medium is a third-person psychological horror game that features patented dual-reality gameplay and an original soundtrack co-composed by Arcadius Rykowski and Akira Yamaoka. Delve deep into a mature and morally ambiguous story, where nothing is what it seems and everything has another side. As a medium, you see, hear, and experience more than others, and with every new perspective, you will change your perception on what happened at the newer resort. The medium is expected to release the 28th of January for the Xbox Series and PC. And that's it guys, tell me in the comment section below which ones you're looking forward to the most. And if you want to see more gaming news, reviews, and release roundups, be sure to like, subscribe, and hit that notification bell so that you never miss another upload. And I'll see you when I see you. That's awesome.